with the knowledge of this ship's mission. Hello everyone and welcome back to the high seas. We are out here right now on a mission to protect Chakuma Garibaldi's trade ship that is on the way outside of this region. And there is already some attacker enemy warship coming over there right now. But of course we'll not have much of a chance there as we can well quickly hopefully get rid of it. Unfortunately my ships are not the smartest ones right. They want to get close to the ship. I can't understand why they would like to do such a thing and they're Sand very very hesitant to attack uh we could destroy it really and i think we can yeah let's go ahead and destroy it there you go down Production and let's quickly get back to jacomo again definitely should not leave this one alone it's one of the first escort missions so it's not going to be too difficult perhaps one perhaps two attackers um that would appear here and that's it right my ships are doing a good job at that oh, now also another uh, milestone that we finally the finished and that is we have now medium trade ships there it is uh, the britannic already on its way it's a bit smaller looking still but it's already it can already carry more um goods right so it has four cargo slots available and it's on the way right now to ashgabat because in ashgabat there's some 36 tons of mosaic already waiting for us and we urgently want to use them for our first pleasure guard in sleepy goods. hollow i can also go ahead with a bit more upgrades here in ashgabat and i think we are actually yeah we're looking fine on dates and milk so we you could also go ahead and the have Orient. the next district for ashgabat working then as well that would be just over here really or actually on that side. That might be better. There you go. Getting us a few more buildings out here. Though Ashgabat is not the focus of my playthrough, right? Um, I've already had a playthrough where we focused on the Oriental Town. And it's just not something I enjoy too much. As it's only two tiers really re needing a lot of product. So you can't really make something big out of it. Except for using the same two buildings there all the time. So it's really just there for uh, providing us with a bit of production and um, taxes and basically also unlocking buildings that we need for productions that we need for the old world all right old world everything is stable now right so finally um my products are looking good meat is also not running out anymore the only thing we really need is that pleasure an garden was settled by another player oh, oh where's that over here all right it's far away fortunately the convoy is still on its way safely and britannic has arrived in ashgabat getting us the mosaic to sleep hollow we still have this brine deposit here that i would like to use so let's go ahead and get rid of those two buildings there sorry pals and build us a warehouse instead um and then we can use this deposit there just fine right next to it really close to the ocean there um and the salt works i do have somewhere over here a bit further away in my industrial zone which we're going to expand now and by the way that charcoal burner here let's get rid of that uh, we might just move it, really. Hmm, now that I think about it. Yeah, let's move it for now. Hmm, let's just see. It's tricky, it's tricky. We don't really need the coal from the charcoal burners that much anymore. There I can do it, right? But the because the coal mine is becoming re relevant soon then, and yeah. For now, let's do this. And then we have a bit of space here, once more available to us, um, that we can use for some more salt works because salt is just really really important at this point uh two three salt works in addition just very good overall those two full deposits i was speaking about earlier hmm, since we have the money uh, we can actually get another medium trade ship out there let's do this having two of them is better than having only one and we still have 15k over so we will be able to build another one again if we want to these ships are just way faster than the small ones and the decreased additional storage of course comes in just very very handily very good um Fire also is cost is going city. down but i'm not bothering about cost that much right now it's the mosaic the trade ship is then taking yeah uh, some goods. wood and some tools with it because we're selling on another island once more this case in this time it's uh, this one up here it's a bit further away then right so there is already another island in between but it's still within our reach um for cloth so this is cloth island it doesn't really have the best fertility there no wheat no um herbs no honey or something like that um and but lots of iron and stone deposits that we can use there as well in addition but cloth it is um for that additional income now we have the mosaic let's go ahead pleasure garden eight thousand it costs if me that just, that just hurts overall uh but it has a huge range right so we don't need to build that many of them 
Um, I'm probably going ahead and build one here a new somewhere. Island has been sighted. And that is just looking like a very good location here. So let's get rid of uh, that ready. block. And get us the pleasure garden in here. And look at that. Production it's a beautiful big disrupted. park. Who would have thought? And it's taking in the whole southern or left side of my, my city. There you go. Production so another one over here. Disrupted. And then probably two more uh, on the northern side. But there it is. The last building that we needed. Uh, let's reduce the taxes for the patricians. Hurting us there a bit. But everything is now fully used. Uh, we have some mosaic there as well. The mosaic is going to be used for upgrading too. So Marlin um, could be doing that. I do already have a trade route here. Let's just see quartz. Wait a second. Quartz, quartz is not something that I need. Um, it was something like pottery. There it is, right? Delivering that. And we're going to add another one here in Ashkemad for the, the mosaic and deliver that to Sleepy Hollow. And we're no longer using the smaller trade ship here that we have, but rather a medium one Marlin that just arrived to this world. And this guy is now on the way, right? And Rashida, she's just going to unload the remaining pottery and that's it. So that we have an additional trade route now that it, uh, well, actually just not an additional trade route, but just a ship that is transporting mosaic because we're going to need that one here for the upgrades. No, actually it's glass, but we do need mosaic anyway for more parks and stuff like that. Now the first uh, patricians want to upgrade. We have the materials really. Let's just wait there a couple of seconds really. So I have four. There you go. So we can finally go for the first block. No Boom. Have settled in your city. There we got them. Beautiful buildings now. Your settlement wants for nothing. Fabulous. We get another 500 honor for that. And we also unlock more buildings now, like the university. Right? Like the level 2 buildings, basically. So the theater would be then possible. The surgery is now available to us. Um, also, oh, the also the card is probably declaring war now. We should be red with him now. We are. Uh, probably even demanding money is not going to work out anymore. And the coal mine has been unlocked with that as well. And I would like to use that immediately. Because we're going to need a no lot of coal. Mercy. Yeah. And there's the war declaration from the Cardinal. Nothing I could have done about that. What I can still do though is I'm going to wait. We have still that peace item, right? With which I can um, you must force have peace. Something to offer the there it is. So the let uh, peace edict, um, lead peace edict. Uh, five minutes it would take, so we're going to wait um, and see just what his move is. If he's attacking with full force, disrupted. then we can still use that item. My ships, meanwhile, are now back to Giacomo Garibaldi with the proof that we have successfully done this escort. Now, in that case here, we are now, as we can see, though, in, I think, the Cardinal's territory What's there as well. That's Leif here. Oh, there's the Cardinal. He's got the same color as Marie on the map. That is a bit confusing. Uh, let's just check it out. Is I this the Cardinal too? Oh, it's the Cardinal as well. And this one is Marie. Well, yes, this one is Marie. So with Marie, we're still friendly. Let's use her harbor as a jump point. Um, and then we go here. And then we go all the way down here to Giacomo. And I hope my fleet can do this safely. Now, um, what we still need is cannons then as my next one. But cannons is something I don't have yet. And I think... Getting cannons is going to be more difficult. Iron and wood for the cannon foundry. It is ridiculously expensive, but we need it. Let's go ahead Oops, and get us the cannon foundry out. The first of many, I guess. We could build a second one as well if we want to. It's just lots of money. Let's just keep the one here for now, right? Um, and I think we are full on iron anyway. We are perfect and wood as well. So in that case, the cannons can come in now. With this beautiful building there um, and with that we can then finally also start building medium warships that are going to help us out a keep might be an interesting one we can build this one for training soldiers i'm still going to wait on that because we need provisions for soldiers and that the is Sultan something i don't have right four crates where oh, just here really we are close to that you ooh, four thousand coin i take that you have discovered another player's island so let's get the crates and then we get to Venice, and then we get to the Grand Vizier. Finishing two quests then in a row. Enemy Lots of honor, in your and also wife. money. There he is already. He's attacking one of my smaller islands now. That was quick. But backing off again, please. 
are you? One of your plants has Alright, he's backing off again. Good. We have some medium protection or smaller protection in Sleepy Hollow already, so that is fine. But he's definitely going to send more ships in now. We need to be prepared, prepared for that, actually. I'm not really... Life in this town is uh, but we can upgrade people. Let's upgrade the next block of noblemen. One of your ships is being attacked by Corsairs. And also here. Very good. That's a lot of noblemen, actually. More than I expected. Looking good. And probably, yeah, those guys here too. We should actually be unlocking something soon. That's it, right? That was a lot of noblemen now. There you are. And yeah, lots of goods as well. Spices we need for them. Wine we do need. We do need two additional clothes. Uh, glasses they would like. Jewelry they would like. Stuff like that. Let's increase taxes. There are a tiny bit for them. And we do already have the first 900 in. When do we unlock the next one? With 950 we would be a major city. Corsairs so are attacking your ship. Try that. There it is. Major city. Sleepy Hollow. Another milestone achieved. Your um, and 300 honor nothing. on top of it. That's nice. It's a bit disrupted. problematic that my main fleet is so far outside One there right now, so really, really it. should hurry up no about it. With the four crates, there it is. And now let's move here. Let's move to Venice there right away. Finish those two quests and get them home then for protection, right? Cannons, meanwhile, please let cannons be in. There it is the first two tons. We do need 10 tons for one ship and money. That is actually something that we don't have, so that's the bigger problem there. And let's also go ahead and get us a few more lumberjack cuts out. Something that I also will need more. And there I have a bit of space there still for two more. Perfect. In this little area. So we'll upgrade that warehouse. And then I guess just see. There we can still have another one. They really don't need a lot of space. That is the good thing about them. And another one here. And also the next upgrade then right away. So that the timber is coming in. We had 2,000 credits. And that is without even the patricians being boosted there. We can definitely yep, upgrade a couple more of them as long as we can. So let's go ahead and have these guys here being leveled up. Inferno is destroying to the next. Your settlement. There you go. As it is growing. And by the way... Do they still need the chapel? I think they do still need the chapel there. Yes. So the chapel is still providing for them. An island was sighted. But that is something that we might also get rid of then at some point. Um, Here we are now. Let's settle. It's risky. In Bolham. <laughs> and Bolham is going to get us the cloth. So not something very valuable. But it's something that we need for now. Um, and we can get a, a quite a few of them out there, right? So this block here, lots of sheepies, and then also over here, and over here, and one more. Yeah, there you go. That's already quite a lot, actually. Production has been disrupted. Just the basic stuff that we got over. Get more sheepies out. 18 and 18, and this whole row is now fully working. Upgrading is not possible, but at least we got the... Actually, I think it's not possible. Nah, still not. Fine, fine, fine. Let's get the trade route done. So this is cloth now only. That was already going down there pretty steeply. And now we can provide a new product then as well to Sleepy Hollow. Ah, we still have some in store. Right, and Britannic is going to be on this trade route here. Alright, since we do need money now for the ships soon, I'm going to now increase the taxes again for everyone. The peasants, the citizens, the patricians, and also the noblemen will go to yellow. That gives me 3,200. Perfect. It's a nice balance that we can use for now. And this one will provide the money that we need for our first medium warships then. I think both of these, the cannons and the money, will be ready at the same time. Um, so that we can pump out the first one then. Up some ah, and, and the beggars. 16,000 is tempting, but an invasion now while we're at war with the cardinal is not good, so good. I'm going to allow. And we already built the arms house, so they can just move in there and be happy about it. And that's the truth. 
Right, we can turn in the first quest at Giacomo. That's, That's the honor and the the letter joking customs. So levy levies uh, duties from trading partners at the warehouse above a certain quantity of goods, um, and five tons of letter jerkings for every fifteen tons of uh, goods that are being traded. So this is really good, right? We can get a lot of letter jerkings in this way um, with our main harbor area. Let's take the remaining ships and get them down here to the Grand Vizier that we can also finish that quest here. That's money. Money is One of your thing. ships is being attacked. Yeah, Michael also Sarah. the pirate. He's becoming a bit, you know, confident now that the Cardinal has so much. You are only one oh, step away. and there, uh, the Cardinal is starting an invasion on Sleepy Hollow. So we are going to use the item now. You are now in control here. Now ensure with the cardinal, stays. right? So he's forced peace now, um, and we will use this time here to first of all get my fleet over. Um, but we will also need to start building up now an army of ourselves. So disrupted. either we build the watchtowers. Oh, he actually moved the the thing away again. Hmm, that's good, that's good. But I still need to build towers. I'm we can't afford an army really at this point. But towers is going to be the the primary thing here it's an invasion army right is we can see that there it is a large madness. transport boat this one we need to intercept them before they can get to my island um so i need to be very careful there and there's another one coming in so they would really like to land here now we can do something else we can just build houses here so they have no way of building something here right because these landings they do require some space for the soldiers to land and if we do it like that um, they don't have any possibility of actually landing there. At least that is my that's my hope. And we have the Historic Warehouse Foundation, the first monument available um, that we can get out there. But yeah, I don't have, I just don't have anything for that right now. Uh, let's go ahead and let's build us a, yeah, a, a wall here. Just a bit. So that he's not able to land in that area, right? There's no space now for landing. Um, and here we have the fishermen. We could also do the same thing by the either use the remaining space for a wall or get us some harbor area buildings out there. Like the large fishermen. Eh, that's not possible. The small one is not possible. Nothing here is possible anymore because we've built the, the salt works there. Um, let's get rid of that. Right, and that should make it possible to build something again. All right, very strange. There's no possibility of building anything here, it seems. All right, then I will have to need a wall One of your plants has stopped producing goods. in this area. Unfortunately, I think we cannot get the you wall too closer me. to the harbor area, as you can see. Um, that will lead to him being able to, I think, land in this area. I will just see about that. All right, I still have lots of beaches, though. And there is his transport boats, and look at that, because he's forced to peace, right? He needs to wait, and the pirate is attacking him at this moment. That's really great. And we have the money, please. Yes, we have everything for a first medium warship, which is being constructed now. That's going to be great for us. That's a lot of damage that we can push out there soon. Um, this area is safe though. This area should be safe now too from him. Pirate unfortunately is backing off again. And the peace treaty is running out soon. In 2 minutes and 10 seconds. I'm going to use my honor to upgrade the diplomatic actions there two times. So that was 300 honor. So we have now a probability uh, of success chance increased by 30% for um, diplomatic actions. And I'm hoping that with that we're at 70% so now, very good, there you can see it, also more reputation, that we can get this up again <laughs> at some point so that with money we can afford a piece. Mm, where's my, uh, the warship, taking its time there still, those pirates really want to know the truth. And I will probably also need watchtowers and stuff like that. Here Corsairs we can also protect us ship. with a wall. That should be possible. One of your ships is being attacked by Corsairs. Yeah, that's looking good. I don't think he can actually invade here then. Right, so this might be very good. And here we have lots of sheepies. Let's use this area there too. God, I hope this works. Right, going all the way up there and here as well. This area is almost fully utilized with fishers. 
And we will just use the remaining ones for fishes too. So he will of course need to clear these buildings. That is my that is my strategy here right now. He will need to clear these buildings first. Thus he will need to send in warships. Um, and we can we can destroy these warships. And this harbor area is the most dangerous one. That we are probably going to fortify with some proper towers now. Right, so we should be having a couple of them. There's the watchtowers and these are going to fight enemies at range. And keep them at bay at least until my ships arrive. That should be the goal here. Ah, my fleet. There's Ship something ready. wrong with my fleet. For some reasons, they don't want to move. It's the third time that I'm that I'm telling them now, please go up there. And please do it. We need to watch them very closely there. We're wasting a lot of... Treaty is no longer valid. A lot of time and energy with you that. Are. My warship is out. Let's go to the transport ships. Nice one. Alright, I guess. Octopus, it's called. For the next one, ah, we don't need them with the money. I think weapons, the cannons, they could be coming in, right? But the rest... Now invalid, but we're still at peace, it seems. Yeah, we're still at peace with him. Now that's strange. The item is gone, though. Right, it's out. Um, I guess... That was not only for five minutes. I guess we are at permanent peace at least until he declares war again. Which he will, of course. But it, it still gives us a bit more time again. These four transportation ships, they want to land on my island, right? And that's that's going to hurt if they can do this. So let's just let's just get my ships over there. Um that we can quickly destroy them once this happens. Um let's get my small warships actually back home now. And only the flagship, which is risky. But only the flagship is now on its way to Grand Vizier. We need to hurry up there. I can't I can't waste my ship so long. They need to get back up. Production Money is coming in for the next ship then hopefully. And hopefully we still have a couple more minutes before he declares war again. Um, so that we can then go out, full out once more on him. That would be Grand really. Um, also resource wise we should be looking really good. The cloth should be going up again. Everything else is um, almost capped now. And even the pottery very the good. So so far no the town is exists. growing nicely. Even though we are at war and who knows what comes out of that. Mm. Stay tuned.